And this, therefore, is our point of departure. That we here, perhaps, perhaps not, mutually realize there is nothing we can do to be anything else than what we are. To feel any other way than what we feel at this moment. And to be then this quaking mess which has the capacity for the horrors about what life can do to us. However, this isn't as much of a blind alley, a cul-de-sac, as it sounds. Because if you discover a blind alley, it tells you something. Watch the flow of water when it crosses over an area of land, and you will see that it puts out fingers and some of them stop because they come into blind alleys. The water doesn't pursue that course. It simply rises and then it finds a way it can go. But it never uses any effort. It only uses weight, gravity. It takes the line of least resistance and eventually finds a course. We think that when we come to a dead end, a blind alley, oh, I failed. Supposing the water at each place where a finger of water stretches out over dry ground and doesn't go any further because the land is too high the water were to say to itself, I failed. We would say it was neurotic water. <laughs> <laughs> Just wait, and it will find a way. Now, when you find, you see, that there's, there's this predicament that I've been describing to you, that there's no way of transforming yourself to become this fearless, joyous, divine being is distinct from the quaking mass. When you says no way, this is not a gloomy announcement. It is a very, very important communication. telling you something because the like the land is telling the water this isn't the way to go there's another way try over here so in the same way life is telling you that's not the way to go it's telling you the the, the message underlying this is you cannot transform yourself is giving you the message that the you that you imagine to be capable of transforming yourself doesn't exist. In other words, an ego, an I, separate from my emotions, my thoughts, my feelings, my experiences, who is supposed to be in control of them, cannot control them because it isn't there. And as soon as you understand that, things will be vastly improved.